Welcome back, everybody. It is Friday, August 23rd, and we're about to watch the final six games of the PBA Tour Trials, where 12 bowlers' lives are going to change forever. I can't reiterate this enough because I still think it's so cool that these bowlers have this opportunity to get all their entries paid for for the season and just focus on bowling. Take me to Candyland. Ooh, take me to Candyland. Sweeter than sugar, you doing a dancing dance. This is really exciting. Man, I want to see a few of my friends make it. I want to see the emotion. I'm just super excited. I love bowling. And I'm currently, I just got gas, clearly. But um, I'm right near my hotel, about an hour away, because Cameron and I are bowling mixed doubles tomorrow, and I wanted to be closer to where we're going tomorrow. So I'm an hour away. It's already 6.20, so I'm probably going to miss the first game or two. But... The action comes at the end. So let's get there and let's see what's happening. Oh, also, here's the results after the first seven blocks. So going into this block, here is what we got. And now let's go. I hate to do this and bring any type of negative energy into this, but I need to address some of my comments. And this is the only time I want to do this because it's just nobody's business. But there's been multiple comments asking, who are you here watching? Who are you dating? Nobody. Nobody. Literally nobody. It was like, she drove all the way out there and just to watch. Yeah, I did, actually. I am here just to watch. I enjoy watching bowling. I enjoy making content. This is like a business trip in my eyes because I can post all this content, which is what I love to do. I like to spread bowling awareness because I know there's people who would love to be here that are not able to be here. Finley was on my way back to Wichita from home, was planning staying here for a couple days, but then a tournament came up, um, was gonna bowl the PWBA regional, but then this other mixed doubles tournament came up, which has more money in it. And ultimately, I'm trying to make some money bowling, believe it or not, and YouTube is one of my sources of revenue. I'm always gonna be transparent. And as soon as I'm dating somebody, nobody will probably know because this i hate that it gets to me in any way but wow some people just suck <laughs> okay that's it i hate having to bring any negativity in my videos but again i really want to be genuine and transparent on here and just this is the price you pay for putting your life online i guess so I see all the positive comments. I love reading them. I try to respond to all of them that I can. If you genuinely just enjoy my content, thank you. And if you're somebody like that guy, go away. <laughs> I, was, I don't know if that was you or not. <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> all right.
So these two, Frank and Chris, are tied, and they can strike out for the same game here. Leading the event at plus 13.17. From McKean, Pennsylvania, Hayden Stippich. In third, from Seaford, Delaware, Mr. Tim Foy, Jr. In fourth place, from Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, Nate Purchase. Finishing in fifth position, from Denton, Texas, please welcome Ryan Barnes. In sixth place, representing Sweden, please welcome Kim Bolivy. Finishing up in <laughs> Finishing in 10th from Westboro, Massachusetts, Andrew Hall. Just becoming a PBA member in the last month in preparation for this event. Outstanding finish from Las Vegas, Nevada, Chase Nadu. From Ireland, please welcome Christopher Sloan. Thank <laughs> you. 